see in this uh, problem 3.158 a metal ball of radius a is located at a distance l from an infinite ideally conducting plane the space around the ball is filled with homogeneously poor conducting medium of resistivity though a is much much smaller than l that means a is almost a point charge the ball is very very small compared to the dimensions of the plate so let's uh, draw the plate like this this is the infinite plate and consider it at earth and this is the ball we can consider it as grounded there is no harm in it a and this distance is l as given at a distance l from infinitely uh, conducting plane the space around the ball is filled with homogeneously poor conducting medium so this row row is the resistivity of the medium where is filled with a medium this now to find current density at the conducting plane as a function of distance r from the ball distance r from the ball means it's as a function of say at a point p at a point p you have to find out current density so this is the distance r okay now as you know the concept of the image method so you know for this there will be an image charge at a same distance l and that to this charge will be ex exactly like the mirror image and it will have negative charge so this is also of radius a so suppose the charge on the ball say the charge on the ball happens to be q then the image charge will be exactly minus q now at the point p you have to find the current density so that means you have to find the electric field at point p you know the field uh, the what is the field how to calculate that see this is also distance r so <coughs> the field due to plus q and the field due to minus q they are vector sum is the resultant electric field at the point p so that means if this is angle theta so each of this field is how much k q by r square so this is twice k q by r square times cos theta okay so that means it's uh, twice i'll write k as 1 by 4 pi epsilon not r square q times cos theta i will write as l by r so e is equal to uh, q l by 2 pi epsilon not times r cube right <coughs> so the current density at this point so it is in the same direction of the field so at point p current density is j j is given as e by rho j is sigma e or you can also write as e divided by resistivity therefore uh, j current density is q l by uh, 2 pi epsilon naught rho times r q okay so this is the answer to part a now next is part b the electrical resistance of the medium between ball and the plane so what is the total current so uh, suppose v is the potential of this ball say let's name this ball as capital a and the ball as capital b and suppose v a is equal to v 
potential of the ball okay so what is potential of the ball a so that is k q divided by a so actually it sh uh, should be also due to the image charge so it should be minus k q by l also but as a is much much smaller than l we can approximate it as k q by a so that is q by 4 pi epsilon naught a and what is the current then i mean the total current flowing through the medium right so there is a total current flowing in the medium right the current flows uh, like this so you have to find out the current so the current uh, so actually the resistance between uh, conductor a that is ball a and the plane is equal to v a minus zero the plane is r divided by i the current now we will find out the current next so that is the plate i mean the uh, this a and that is the image charge b and in between you have the plane now to find out current flowing through this what we'll do we'll apply gauss's law so i'll consider a gaussian surface across this So that total current is the current crossing the Gaussian surface. That is the net current which flows in the medium. So I can write this current is equal to integration of J dot dA. dA is the small area A dA over this Gaussian surface. So E this is the electric field E. Uh, so J equal to uh, E by rho e by rho dot dA so it's 1 by rho into integral e dot dA now what is integral e dot dA that is q by epsilon naught so therefore the equivalent resistance between A and the plate and the plate is R equivalent equal to v a divided by i v a minus 0 divided by i so what is v a v a is 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught q by a divided by this i so that is rho okay. epsilon naught q by 4 pi epsilon naught a q so the q's will cancel out epsilon will cancel out so the resistance comes out to be rho by 4 pi a